morning. Um, it is 6, 6.24. Um, I'm making some coffee. Um, this is my first, like, official morning at work. Um, I'm a little nervous. I really fell asleep last night. Um, I ended up sleeping though at, like, 1 a.m. I fell asleep sometime around then. So I'm, like, really thankful because I've been having a really hard time sleeping. I'm going to show you guys. I'm like, bringing taco salad for lunch. So I have Doritos, um, spicy Doritos. And then in case I want more, I'm going to eat this bar. And then these. So, yeah. I am off to get ready and I'll let you guys know how today goes. I'm going to leave. I'm actually um, making a sandwich, but I wanted to show you guys my outfit. Here's what I'm looking like. Put some boots on. Hopefully the boots are okay. But, yeah. I'll see you guys after work. Hey you guys, I just got home from work um, and I actually got a package in the mail. Super exciting. Um, it's the Built Bar. The new Built Bar um, pumpkin chocolate chip cookie. So I'm going to give it a try. Um, it looks like this. I don't know. I'm kind of weirded out, but I'm going to try it um, and see what I think. I haven't been too on the Built Bar kick lately because I don't know. I tried the Alani new ones. Oh, 10 out of 10. You guys so good. But anywho, I'm going to try this and I'll let you guys know what I think. Okay, so I'm filming for YouTube over here and I wanted to film for you guys my reaction. Say hi, Jay. <laughs> He's in the camera. Anyways, let's try it. I just cut the end off because I don't really like just trying it right from the chocolate or whatever, but... It's good, but it needs to like, it's like melted, so it's really chewy. I don't know. It's good, but it's too melty. I think I need to like try it when in the fridge, but I like the flavor. It tastes like a chocolate chip cookie, but like pumpkin. I don't know how to explain it, but look it. It's like all dark. I don't know. I kind of like it. It's kind of weird. Just know these, I always preach this. These are not necessary to lose weight. They're just a protein bar. Um, they're like very chocolatey, chewy. Um, they're not for everybody. So just be cautious. If you have had them before, they're pretty much the same. They do have like all of the new stuff going on. But they're literally the same, you guys. So yeah, anyways. Um, but if you're a Built Bar fan, I actually genuinely like this flavor. So I'm kind of excited to see what it's like if when it's cooled cooled off it's not melted so i did stick them in the fridge this is just an empty box but anyways i had a really good day at work um i did stop i already threw it away because i drank it all but i did stop at taco bell and got a baja blast zero for zero points um and then i don't know what we're gonna have for dinner tonight but i work tomorrow till two so that's nice um but yeah my brain is like fried so i'm tired and but i'm excited so Anyways, um, yeah, I need to catch up on YouTube. I haven't posted on YouTube in a while, so it's kind of depressing. That's why I, like, was up and at them today. I'm like, I'm going to film a little bit before work. Yada, yada, yada. I also, since we're on the pumpkin flavor, um, I tried these, Pumpkin Spice Premiere. They're all right. I mean, I don't know. I wouldn't, like, I don't crave this. I crave, um, the Quest Caramel. Oh, that one. But the Premier Protein is like alright. They give me that like moldy after flavor still. I don't know how to like compare because everyone's like, do you prefer Premier Protein or do you prefer um, Quest? And it's hard to explain because I genuinely love the Quest one because it doesn't leave that like moldy, icky flavor in my teeth. I don't know how to explain it. And then if you know if you if you know you know um and then the premier protein like it tastes really good um it's more sweet and then the quest one is more caramely and like rich so it's not so sweet and i really really like that so yeah anywho um, hopefully i can remember to show you guys my dinner right you guys well i love you and insert my dinner or like a few more clips but just know that i'll try to post more it's just a lot going on with the new job so bear with me i love you guys
Hi you guys, good morning, good afternoon. It is like 12ish and Jason and I just made some brunch. I actually could only eat one. It was very filling, super good. And Jason actually ate the other one for me and he gave it an eight out of 10. I'm giving it an eight out of 10. El Montre, I think that's how you say it, Montre. Um, egg, potato, and bacon with cheese sauce. So pretty good. Two of them for 10 points or one for five. And honestly, like I said, one of them was so filling and like totally enough so um i would highly recommend this if you were like a busy body wrap it up you can microwave it for a minute 30 um two point coffee super good be fierce you guys <laughs> it is sunday um i don't know the date september 27th sunday and it is one o'clock a little brunch we slept in today i love sundays sundays are my favorite i'm going to be working full time for a while from 7 30 to 4 most days on um, training um i do have to kind of figure out what i'm going to be eating so i'm going to be eating one of those for breakfast probably um i'm not a huge breakfast person so that's why i was trying to find things that would like not make me feel sick because normally you guys when i eat breakfast in the morning like i used to be able to my dad used to make it for us <laughs> jason's watching us in powers um, my dad used to make um, me, my brother, my mom breakfast every single day. Um, and I would just wake up and eat right away. Also, don't mind my spray tans coming off. I'm going to exfoliate it off tonight. But So I w used to eat breakfast all the time. And then as I got older, as I started to just drink coffee right when I woke up and drove to work, I stopped wanting to eat breakfast. To me, is like a blessing and a sin because sometimes i wake up hungry and i want to eat but my body like when i eat it makes me feel sick so if you have any really good breakfast recommendations um besides caramel premier or like you know like a protein coffee let me know down below because i would love some recommendations i don't have a commute to work i will be working from home so i can kind of make anything but yeah so any hoosier i wanted to show you those five points for one you can have two for ten but one is plenty pair it with like some yogurt or like some fruit um vegetable whatever you want and it's actually super filling so putting together my new desk i'm so excited um i have this desk here and it was really weak oh. in the middle nice babe <laughs> it was really weak in the middle um because it's obviously not a desk it's like a little table um because here's my computers for work and yeah my sweet honey you're so sweet so yeah i'll show you guys what it looks like when it's all done okay you guys here's my little desk set up so we got this little floor mat at fleet farm and then my desk is from fleet farm as well it's super nice you guys it's super big um can I tell there? But yeah. So let me show you. Um, we're actually gonna run to Target and get me like a like a um, extension cable for my computers to have like more plugins because clearly I need them. I have two monitors, and then that guy needs to be plugged in. And yeah. So here, um, you can't really see, but there's a shelf right here, and it's just a typical drawer. And then this here um, is a you can like obviously put stuff or you can use it as um like a keyboard shelf so that's pretty dope love that so here we got drawer this can be a file cabinet so i thought that, that was pretty cool and then this one here is just another drawer we had a little hard time with this one <laughs> pain in the booty thank you to my jason it's all set up so we're gonna run to target and get the pen um, I actually just cleaned it because it was marking easy with my Scentsy Clean. Counter Clean. This stuff is amazing. Now my whole room smells delicious. So I love this, this scent. Um, I do sell this Scentsy. So if you ever wanted to pick some up, um, I'll, I always have the link in my description box. So everything is looking good. My first day is actually tomorrow. Like I'm going to be shadowing and stuff. So I'm like really nervous, but I'm like excited. Nervous, you know? So future Brittany, when you're editing this, you're probably going to be like a few weeks into training. So I hope it's going good. <laughs> I'm not going to cut that out. I want to leave that because training is scary and like learning a new job is freaky. So I don't know. I'm just excited for like 
a change, new beginnings, and just hopefully a place where the job treats me right. That's all we ask for, you know? It's miserable to be working for somebody that treats you like absolute shit. Just saying. Um, throwing that out there. I'll let you guys know how my first day goes tomorrow. I'm probably just going to be shadowing, so it's not going to be a big deal, but I'll still update you, you know? So, I'm going to head upstairs now and just hang out with Jay. It's not focusing. My room is still a disaster. This is all my Scentsy stuff. Um, because you guys know, I just told you I still Scentsy, so like... That was all like my sample stuff, like um, soaps and all of that fun stuff. I do need to clean that up though before tomorrow so that I can have a nice clean area. Hi you guys, good morning. Um, it is 10.30, I've been up since 6.45 and I've just been having like the roughest start to my morning. Sorry, I'm messing with my hair. Because my computer stuff wasn't working, I couldn't get logged in, but um, they're helping me out. I'm waiting actually on a phone call um from the help desk so like the anxiously waiting feeling really annoying but that's fine i'm just enjoying my view actually working on some of the um the training programs i'm supposed to be doing or whatever so that is good a lot of other things to go over too so taking like a two second break to talk to you guys and um um there's somebody in our yard doing our stuff so and he just saw me videoing myself so that's great um, whatever, I don't care. I've been drinking some water. I actually, let me grab it. I actually was trying this out this morning, but I don't like it at all. This is the cherry vanilla sparkling ice, um, like caffeine drink. I haven't had coffee yet today and I definitely like am craving a cup of coffee right now. So I actually might head upstairs and just keep my phone on me and just like hope that they don't call me while i'm up there but they probably will that has been the struggle this morning just, i better get back to work um i've been on take off took a five minute break here so i better get back to these um little learning segments i put some lights up last night um i don't like that you can see that so i don't know what i'm gonna do with that i might like figure out how to hang that behind the picture when i make lunch um i'll just show you my lunch because i'm actually gonna make my chicken patty again the mixed chicken that i made before um but i'll just show you it because i didn't get to show you as my sandwich my last vlog so i'll definitely show you then came up today my handsome man of mine made me my sandwich but i want to show you guys like how i make it but he made it for me today but i just buy the bun these buns um i like the light italian bun but couldn't find them this week i use one tablespoon of light mayo and then i like the green shredded lettuce and then um he baked it for me today here's the patty this is the morning star farms patty bake them in the oven microwave them first and then bake them because i don't have the time but um since we both work from home i messaged him hey can you put a thing in the oven for me and he did and then now i'm over cheeseburger soup for six points um i didn't video how i made that but um or how jason made that but um i probably will like make a crock pot recipe of it or something somehow one day with chicken or i don't know we'll figure it out but anyways, I only have 30 minutes, so I'm gonna go eat, and yeah. I love you guys so much. I'm probably gonna end the vlog here. On that note, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for being here, and I will see you guys in the next one. Please don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. That makes me aware of the videos that you like to see, and if you like these videos. So anyways, um, thank you for listening to my little rant about my work, and I love you guys so much. See you in the next one. Bye, guys. Thank <laughs> you.